Hey guys, hope everyone's having a great day. I apologize for my appearance, but I wanted to get to this little unboxing that I promised you guys I would get to um, on my last video. So anyways, wanted to jump right into that. Um, it is a Sunday, so I'm super casual today. Um, we just came from a little walk, so wearing my sports clothes. Um, anyways, wanted to get to this. As you can see, I have this huge box. Um, I purchased this from Trade Z, so um, I have it in the Tradesy box. I purchased it from not one of the sellers that I recommended. Um, this is actually a seller that I was watching for a little while, and she had it priced at a really good price, as you can see. Um, so we're going to jump right into that. So the Tradesy box is an extra bonus. You actually have to pay for this. Um, this was $35 extra. And um, that's kind of, a, it's a good and a bad incentive. It's not something that I necessarily would want to buy, but the seller usually likes to package it in something really trusty like this. So here's the big box. Um, jumping into it, here it was, here's what it looks like inside. She packaged it with the receipt, which is really nice. So she was the original owner and she packaged it with the original receipt. And this, um, it comes with the little Louis Vuitton. Um, she paid after tax thirteen thirty five for this, and then she also gave me the business card, and she actually shipped or bought it in Boca Raton, Florida. So there's that. Really nice. Um, kind of an extra bonus when the seller ships it with this. It's kind of nice because in the long run when you're reselling or if you do resell your bag, it's um, kind of an added perk. People really like to see that it's authentic and this kind of adds into the fact of that. So jumping into the bag, came in this Louis Vuitton dust bag. And as you guys probably can already tell by the shape, this is the Neverfull mm so same size as i showed in my last video of my damier bean but this is the damier azure and this is the mm size in like i said damier azure so it's that lighter color um i feel like it's a really nice neutral it's great for work and great for um weekends and every day so it came in really great shape as you can tell it's really light the leather is a light patina um, it also came with the little pochette. Um, I actually already sold that to a friend of mine, so unfortunately I don't have it. I'm sorry about that. Um, but it is a nice, it's probably a little bit bigger than this, and it has a little attachment to it. I'm sure you guys have already, already seen it. Um, there are plenty of videos out there that would, uh, show that. But anyways, just kind of wanted to go into why I picked this bag. First of all, it was a great price for both the pochette and the bag. So it was like a two for one -er. And a lot of people end up selling um, one or the other. So it's kind of nice because it kind of made up for how much I spent on this to sell the little pochette. Um, I feel like it would have been great. I would have probably kept it if it was in a darker color. And I probably will buy it in the dummy bean color. So there's that. Um, so anyways, I checked for a clean interior. Uh, the interior is super clean, nothing major, no major callouts. Uh, the only major nick that had on this was the little water spot, which I don't think you're going to be able to see. It's very minimal. I checked the corners. The corners were fine. Um, I checked to see if there's any color transfer. This bag is known and prone for um, having color transfer and there was nothing. I mean, all of the straps are fine interior-wise. Um, this bag was actually made in the USA, and you'll see by this little tag right here. Um, it's a little made in the USA tag. Underneath this shows the date code, and the, it's really hard to see or I'd pulled up for you guys. Um, so yeah, this is my reveal, and I'm really, really excited. Uh, it fits everything that I need, binders, shoes, um, so anyways, it's, it's something that I'm really excited to have in my collection. I know it's weird to have two Neverfulls and a lot of people aren't really keen on that, but I think it's a good addition. I may even try to look into getting, um, the Neverfull GM, the larger size. I've had it at one point, but I'm thinking it may be a nice little travel bag to have, so Anywho, I hope that you guys are all doing great. Again, I wanted to just get this out to you guys and show you guys my new baby, my new reveal. 
Um, let me know if you guys have any questions or have any comments about this. Um, I hope I gave you guys a little bit more insight. Um, feel free to watch my other video as to how I buy pre-loved. Um, I feel like I'm kind of a pro because I like to get the best deal and I tend to really stock, um, the things that I want. I know what price range I want to pay, so I have the patience to kind of wait and see um, if I could ever find something in that type of realm. So anyways, hope you guys are all having a great day. I look forward to seeing you guys all later. Bye guys.